And thank you so much, Tyler. Our main weather today is brought to you by CNK Variety. Stop by CNK Variety in Herman today for hand tossed pizza, subs, salads, and more. CNK Variety, your local go to convenience store. All right, well, we have a lot in store for us, though. Another low pressure system is on its way. It's going to be moving in tonight, especially into those early morning hours tomorrow. Right now, though, we do have some increase in clouds all across the state indicated here with those darker white colors but look just down south Connecticut starting to get in on a little bit of rain upstate New York New York City Jersey PA they all have some rain showers out there right now some stronger storms are moving in no thunderstorms it is definitely middle of winter but still for us though we will get a little bit of a rain mix um, into those overnight hours then quickly transitioning to a rain and snow mix we're looking at a little bit of freezing rain some sleet mixed in especially closer to 10 11 a.m. then changing over to all snow on the back end and we're looking at a couple inches of snow here in town then it's going to be moving out by tomorrow evening into tomorrow night that's when we'll just be sticking around with some cloud cover in the area and things really start to clear up Friday night into the day on Saturday all right big question how much snow are we going to get all right by the coast not much snow because we're going to get more of a wintry mix, a little bit of rain. In Bangor, here in town, we're looking at around one to three inches of snow. But just up north, there's going to be a lot more snow. We're looking at Millinocket, Greenville area. Uh, Greenville area, we're looking at even possibly closer to six inches of snow, four to six, let's say. And then Millinocket, we're looking at possibly over six inches of snowfall because more of that rain and snow line will be just south of us. We will get a little bit of a rain and snow mix there too, but overall we're looking at a good amount of snow. So Millinocket, yes, we are getting possibly over six inches of snow. We know this is all coming, folks. That's why we do have some winter storm warnings out until around 10 p.m. on Friday and some winter weather advisories. Same story till around 10 p.m. tomorrow. So all of these areas here, uh, here in town, just north of town, Greenville area, looking at some winter weather advisories. And just around Millinocket area and just north, we're looking at winter storm warnings with a lot more snow. So it will be a heavy, wet snow. Then as temperatures cool down, it will be more on the lighter and fluffier end. So we'll be blowing around with that wind that will continue to increase and it will be blowing and gusting at around 30 to even 35 miles an hour in some spots. So be careful out there, folks. It will be breezy and also uh, pretty snowy out there as well. Temperatures have been cooling down. Uh, we were in the 50s earlier today. Look at New York City once again in the 50s, close to 60 out there. Our average high should be around 31 degrees. So by Friday, Saturday, we're looking at near average temperatures. Sunday into Monday, once again, we start to warm up with temperatures in the 40s. Tonight, though, rain, freezing rain, sleet, a little bit of snow mixed in, not much accumulations. Tomorrow, wintry mix transitioning into some snow. We're looking at around one to three inches here in town. Temperatures around the freezing mark in the morning and then cooling off later in the day. Our extended forecast outlook does show 40s are back Sunday into Monday. Then we cool off by Tuesday. Beth and Peter.